The head of Instagram answered questions today from senators about the impact the social media site is having on teenagers. Many are demanding the company make drastic changes, and they are aiming to implement federal legislation to help that become reality. Fox's Madeline Rivera picks up coverage from Washington. Instagram CEO Adam Mazzari is defending his company's practices and policies after coming under fire over its alleged harm to young users. Mazzari deflecting blame. But the reality is that keeping people safe is not just about any one company. An external survey just last month suggested that more teens are using TikTok and YouTube than Instagram. It's his first appearance before Congress, and it comes after internal documents leaked by Facebook whistleblower Francis Haugen earlier this year showed the site's parent company Meta, formerly known as Facebook, knew the platform triggered body image and mental health issues in some teenage girls. Lawmakers demanding to know more about the app's design. There is such a frustration that you turn a blind eye toward taking responsibility and accepting accountability. One day before the hearing, Instagram announced new safety measures that includes reminders for users to take breaks after scrolling for a certain amount of time and parental controls to be launched in March, among other steps. We're also using technology to understand if people are above or below the age of 18 so that we can create a more age-appropriate version of Instagram for them. Some say the actions are not enough. These changes fall way short of what we need. Congress says it's working on bipartisan legislation to better keep children safe online, regulations that Instagram says it's supporting too. In Washington, Mallory Rivera, Fox News.